Hello, in this video I'm gonna show you how to enable Find My iPhone on iPhone 17. Okay, so if you'd like to find your iPhone, enable the uh, Find My iPhone service, which lets you locate your iPhone uh, once you lose it or it gets stolen or you just can't locate it really with your eyes. Maybe it's somewhere near you, maybe it's far away from you. Um, all of those options are possible. Um, well, if you want to activate that service, also uh, it lets you. Um, like find my service um, activates activation lock which means if someone resets your phone without your permission uh, just without unlocking the phone because that's possible via a computer uh, they still won't be able to use the phone because it will be locked with um, activation lock which will require them to enter the email and the password to your Apple account. Now if you'd like to activate your um, find my iPhone service uh, on your iPhone go to the settings and then you can go to your name at the top. If you're not signed into Apple account you'll need to sign into Apple account because without that find my service doesn't make any sense right? So uh, yeah I'm logged in of course and I have find my right here. Now if I wanted to make uh, my find my iPhone work I need to go here and make sure that find my iPhone is enabled um, which lets me locate lock or erase the device now find my network uh, will allow me to locate my iPhone even if the iPhone is powered off or offline because other iPhones around my iPhone uh, will send the location to the server and then I'll need to they'll just locate it you know uh, without intern internet on your iPhone just people around you that have internet on their iPhones will like um, automatically that'll send all the data if they all they also have find my network enabled and most likely they have so I think that's pretty reliable now send last location is also a very good feature because when your battery is critically low it'll send a, the location to Apple so it'll automatically uh, get saved so even if your iPhone has like zero zero percent of battery it'll still you'll still be able able to like know where it was when it had a bit more than zero percent uh, now also my location and now it's set to a different iPhone of mine so if I wanted to use this iPhone as my location I'm gonna explain it in a moment what my location is um, you can click on use this iPhone as my location and you can enable share my location so you can share it with your family friends and stuff like that via messages or via find my app now let's go to find my app to see more about it so now I'm here and um, you can see if I zoom in I'm gonna have all of my devices with me now they are all listed here and um, because on all of these devices I have enabled find my iPhone now what's important here is that the my location can be assigned to one device and my location affects you when you share your location with someone so you can go to for example people click on plus and share my location then select your contact and share your location with that person you can also go to me to adjust some settings here but we've already adjusted them so it like we don't have to do that anymore and yeah so as you see in uh, my devices um, you can locate all, all your devices that you have connected to your Apple account and um, if you want you can select the device that you'd like to um, find so for example let's select a different iPhone than this one uh, and you can play a sound off of it 
so um, like if it's somewhere near you but you just can't locate it for example at home then you can play sound and you'll have an idea where it is if there's directions but I'm too close to the iPhone to give directions because I'm already in the place where the direction like where the iPhone is I can also select lost mode mm, I can turn it on and that will uh, make people unable to unlock my iPhone um, and also it'll tell like a message for example to call a certain phone number so so when they find the iPhone right and you can also erase your iPhone if you'd like so um, <clears throat> But it'll still stay with the activation lock, so it'll require the Apple account to be entered during the setup after erasing the iPhone. And erasing begins once the iPhone is online. Lost mode also begins once the iPhone is online, but um, locating it is um, available even if the iPhone is offline as long as you and people around your iPhone um, have Find My Network enabled. And from what I um, have experienced, I think it works quite great. There's no really problems with it, with like pro people not having it enabled. So it typically locates your iPhone anyway. Um, now, uh, I believe that um, you, yeah, if you don't have like any other device um, from Apple, then don't worry, you can still log in to a website. So let's go to a website. We can go to, um, to the website, right? To the browser and then find iCloud.com. Search for that, then sign in. And now what's great about it is even if I cancel that and I log in manually just with my password mm, I'm gonna do that then mm, typically you know uh, Apple prompts you to um, prompts you to um, like enter a verification code once I enter the passcode I'm gonna show you something yeah, so now it prompts me about the code. I'm gonna click on allow, but I'm gonna click on OK. Uh, yeah, so there's two-factor authentication, but if you've lost your only Apple device, then you won't be able to send the code, uh, to enter the code. So what you can do is scroll down and find the Find Devices section, click on it, and now you can locate all your devices. So I hope that this video was helpful. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.